This HAN Network video is brought to you by A Better View Window Cleaning Plus. From Trinity Catholic High School, this is the 2016 FCAC Fall Sports Tour. For the HAN Network, I'm Frank Renito, and I'm joined by the captains of the girls and boys cross country here, teams here for the Crusaders. They are Stephen Capanetti and Claudia Geyer. Thank you so much for taking time with us, both of you. Claudia, let me start with you. What did it mean being named a captain of the team this year? Um, I thought it was a really cool thing to do. I think it's like a real nice thing for everyone to have a leader, someone to look up to. So I think it's a huge honor. Steven, you guys are just finishing up your preseason training. School will start up this week. Uh, what were the practices like getting ready for the year? Well, you know, it's definitely it's nice to, you know, come to the end of the season, have a nice rest. But really what coach wants us to do is start working on our own, start running, you know, getting into the weight room every now and then really building up. But come Tuesday, that's going to be the big official practice, and we're getting ready for September 13th, the first meet. Claudia, as one of the older players on the team, how do you get the new faces and younger girls acclimated to the cross country at the varsity level? Um, it's just like being really friendly with everyone. Um, I actually got a couple of other people to join and like just encouraging them and saying like just giving them the confidence is really helps. Obviously, the training on the course is important, but the team chemistry comes from sort of the bonding activities all outside of practice. What are some of the things you guys like to do? Um, well, we really like to have fun, joke around, and before um, before and after practice, we always hang out, and it's just like we're just one family, and it's really nice. Steven, what kind of a cross-country team can we expect to see this year from the Crusaders? Definitely a strong one. We have a lot of players that have been doing it for four years, like myself and Claudia, another captain who wasn't here today, but Nathan Britton. Uh, you know, we definitely have some new players, so it's going to be a struggle for them, you know, to get up to, the, you know, eventually varsity level, but we're a family, so we're going to be helping each other out along the way. What goals would you hope to accomplish as a team this year, and what do you have to do in order to accomplish them? Goals would definitely be just, like Coach always says, just to finish. You know, it doesn't matter if you come first, 20th, 25th, doesn't matter. Really, what you need to do is to put in the work yourself and to put in the work for others as well. You got to show up to practice, you got to be there at the meets and just kind of pick each other up when they're down. So as long as we can practice those morals, I think we're up for a great season. Claudia, is there a meet that you're most excited for this season? Um, yeah, it's the last one, the FCX. It's kind of like where all those schools just come in and we just do one final run and it's, I think it's like the best one because it's just like everyone's there and it's cool. How about you, Steven? Any meet stand out? You know, it's cliche, but I have to agree with her. Definitely the final meet where everyone, you have a bunch of schools, a big long line. The course is actually different because there's so many people and really just that one final run, especially for me being a senior and going off to college. I'm really looking forward to it. Well, we're very excited to see both of you and all the Crusaders at the Cross Country Championships in October. Thank you so much for taking time with us, and we want to wish you the best of luck throughout the fall season. Make sure you stay tuned for the 2016 FCAC Fall Sports Tour that continues on right here on the HAN Network.